Simon, bring your fat ass home. Mama cook some collard green fat back meat, cornbread, two piece of biscuit, corn on the car. So I made a poll of what story times y'all wanted to hear, and this one won, so I'm about to tell it. So this took place in my 11th grade year, right? I had this crush, you know, she, she's an enemy now, but at the time back then, she, I used to actually like her, you know, I used to love her, I mean, I still do admit she's fine as hell, but she's a bitch ass nigga for what she did, but I'm not gonna tell that story, that's another story for another time, so this happened Somewhere, like, almost, like, at the end, somewhere mid-end of the school year, you know, I saw my crush outside of, um, outside of the post office or whatever, or, or some shit, and, you know, and I went to go, go get her a hug while she was walking. She told me no, but I gave her a hug anyway. I guess I thought she was playing because she was smiling and grinning while saying it. So I thought she was playing. I didn't know if she was serious. Because I can't really tell where people are being serious or not. Because I think either because I'm naive or something. Or is it my autism? I don't want to say it's because of my autism. Because I don't want to see like no insensitive asshole who uses his autism for... um uses his autism for it as an excuse uh, but anyway back to the story i went to go hug my crush and i hugged her you know it was going good at first and then it started growing my eggplant started growing and it got hard mid hard i want that booty time you can't have my oh yeah back to what i was saying someone came out of that room and I thought they was coming in but anyway I got hard mid hard and you know and it and it touched my thigh while we was walking by the way it was in the middle in the hall by the way I mean bar there was barely people in the hallway but still and it touched her you know and then she said and then she asked what was that oh no 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 I Pre-game. Then she, then she's asked, "What was that?" I heard. I how I know because one, I felt it. Two, I heard it. It was loud. It, it went like, and I and I said, "Oh my goodness!" While my eyes was was wide, so I unhugged her, and I walked to my class, and she walked to hers. And since then, we didn't talk about it. And yeah, so that's the story. Moral of the story is. Yes. Don't try to hug your... Don't hug your crush unless you're ready. I've been hugged by girls before. Hell, I've been kissed by some. But, shit. I don't know. It's just something about her. It just... Just... I just like, I don't know. So, yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this story. As the next time, see y'all tomorrow. And I'm about to uh, tell the story of how I met my internet best friend, aka Ice Wolf. So, uh, yeah, see y'all.